Miss Spider's New Car by David Kirk Mom writes we should come to tea. Let's go, Miss Spider cried. We'll hire a frog to cross the bog down to the riverside. Among the mice, we might entice a fuzzy woodland guide. Those mice could bite you, Holly howled. There's a river full of snakes. To think of you atop a frog gives me the quiver shakes. It's much too far. Let's buy a car instead for heaven's sakes. You're brilliant, dear, Miss Spider cheered. A car would be divine, with sky blue shells and silver bells and shining bits that shine. Look over there, I do declare, that one would suit us fine. Miss Spider grinned. We'll take it home, but Holly only frowned. Would it be wise to buy the first jalopy that we found? I'll ask the bee to wait till three so we can shop around. Mike Mantis crooned, This honey runs on nectar from a flower. Its two-stem engine is equipped with turbo bumble power and capable of reaching speeds of nearly 90 yards per hour. Poor Holly shrieked, It's much too fast. Please look out where you are going. There might be hungry rats down there. We have no way of knowing. How fine it is, Miss Spider laughed, to feel my top be blowing. Slick tail the snail, said Holly, calls this gem the escargo. It looks all sleek and spirally, but the ride's nice and slow. The sails snail, said Mrs. Spider, looks familiar, don't you know? This wheel is out of date, whooped Hop, just like the dinosaur. Our flexibly spring-loaded legs are just what you're looking for. Just pull around the brown throttle down and hear that engine roar. Why travel on the public roads? Such trouble that brings. The bumps and the holes and the toads and the moles, the snakes and rats and things. It's only sense, Meg Malfly begged, to buy this car with wings. It's almost three now, Holly coughed. We really ought to run. I'm certain, dear, the first car was by far the nicest one. Just try this dream, Skid Skipper schemed, and then you shall be done. The springs are shot, Miss Spider moaned. I bounce with every bump. The steering's locked. The brakes won't work, no matter how I pump. That tree is getting awfully close. I think we'd better jump. Miss Spider wailed. They'll sell my car. It's nearly half past three. Then Holly spied a dozing moth and whispered secretly, Excuse me, Sue, but could you do a courtesy for me? Oh, where's my car, my lovely car? She blew her nose and cried. A moth paid cash and drove it home, Bub Bumblebee replied. I'm sorry, ma'am, indeed I am. Me too, Spider sighed. But then upon Miss Spider's long, oh, what a dazzling sight, proud Holly beamed. Moth still came through the way I hoped she might. You knew it from the first, my love. That little car's just right. Beneath the door, upon the floor, Miss Spider found a note. Another message from my mom. I wonder what she wrote. What fun! She wants to take us both out shopping for a boat. 